And this is it. The majority of fans are inside the stadium now, and the tension is palpable here ahead of the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is, of course, Lee Dixon. And we're just moments away from kickoff. It's Leicester City up against Lazio. Well, night games, European football, where does it get any better? Well, it does if you're in the final. But with finals, they're horrible if you lose. Make sure you win if you get here. Here's how Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Wilfred Ndidi plays with Yuri Tielemans in the centre of midfield and operating through the middle in attack, Jamie Vardy. Here are the players who'll start for Lazio. The evergreen Pepe Reina stands between the posts. Stefan Radu plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Sergei Milinkovic Savic plays with Lukas Leva in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. Zeyuncu. Madison with it. Evans. Ayose Perez. Ndidi. Here's Tielemans. Iheanacho. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Tielemans. Ricardo Pereira. Iheanacho. Not showing good defensive judgment. A striker who you can simply never write off. Jamie Vardy, of course, has so much know-how. Lee, what do you expect we'll see from him? Well, pace. Just look how fast he runs. Absolute nightmare for defenders to defend against when the play... Can they forge ahead? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. But I have to say, after that, the keeper doesn't cover himself in glory. Near post, left exposed, and he's punished. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Castagna. Tielemans. Ricardo Pereira. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Iheanacho, Ricardo Pereira, well they want that equaliser but the passing remains smooth. Milinkovic Savic, Manuel Lazzari, here's Milinkovic Savic. Lukas Leva. And using his strength to shield the ball. An incisive pass. He just needs to keep a cool head. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. 
A trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. But as good as the move is, the goalkeeper has had an absolute shocker. Beaten at his near post, terrible. So 2-0 now. James Madison. Now Ricardo Pereira has it. Ricardo Pereira. Now Ndidi. And foul it is then. Ricardo Pereira, options in the centre. Chiro Immobile. Now Correa. Chance to attack using wit. Milinkovic Savic, physically strong and secure on the ball. Leicester controlling possession brilliantly but they have to create more they have to be more positive the final third play has been slow too predictable and there it is still life left in this game and they have the momentum now Well, as we see from the replay, the keeper's got no chance. It's all about the strike, all about the power. He does everything right, head down, back of the net. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, 2-1 it is here. Milinkovic Savic. High quality defending. James Madison. Now Ndidi. Vardy. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. The quest for Europa League success. And the second half of this final is underway. Manuel Lazzari. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Well, that is annoying for any manager to see your own player giving the ball away from a throw-in. A Jose Perez. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Vardy. Ndidi. Madison. Well, it's the sort of determination and desire that's got them here. All the momentum is with them now. Well, just look at the replay. The keeper's a little bit unfortunate. He thinks he's coming back out, but just clips the inside of the post and it sneaks in. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Goals are plenty. 2-2. Two, two. Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. Ndidi. 
Johnny Evans with it. Tielemans. A Jose Perez. Now Ndidi. And he keeps going. They do pass the ball with authority. Madison. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. And good to jump in front. And after the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Regard to that cross, goalkeeper's ball. Pressing high to win the ball. Milinkovic Savic. Playing with purpose and control. Chance to finish. Manuel Lazzari. And players waiting in the centre. Must take the lead here. Oh, a tremendous block. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. And a fine tackle. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Milinkovic Savic. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. Vardy. Ndidi. Sadly, too many things wrong about that effort. Oh, everything was wrong about it. Body shape, positioning, the idea of where he was going to put the ball. It was all going wrong. It's a poor attempt, really, for him. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Marusic. And a goal at this stage could be decisive. Can he put them in front? Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Tielemans. And intercepted it. Lucas Leiva moving it forward tackling and winning the ball to boot and breaking at pace with Menace all hands on deck and they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move Parolo the referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order Tielemans Madison with it and the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. It's gone in! And surely now, it's one hand on the trophy. Well, there's not long left for response now. Is there anything left in the tank? Well, here's the replay with the clock ticking down. Has he won the game for his team? Cool, calm and collected. He deserves that brilliant finish. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. Disappointment on one side but sheer jubilation on the other. And my goodness, Lee, they deserve it. Absolutely deserve it. They were running the clock down at the end. The referee obliged and blew his whistle. And quite rightly so. They're now on the halfway line celebrating with all their teammates. I'm pretty sure all the subs, etc., will come running on as well. A great, great night for this football club. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. to be celebrating good times 
in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them. Well, all those months of hard training sessions, pre-season training, you kind of look forward to get yourself through those sessions. And they'll be looking forward at moments like this. They've finally got their hands on this fantastic, magnificent trophy. This is what they've wanted. Now it's in their possession. The winners of the UEFA Europa League. Long celebrations into the night, I'm pretty sure, Derek. It's going to go on and on. Yeah, I think they have every intention of making this last as long as possible. One more trophy left, why not? Yes. Well, this is the moment I love sharing it with the fans.